if everyone could continue to shit on Batman for me, that would be fantastic. Again, I love these hot takes. This is a hell of a way to start out a stream, first and foremost. Wowie. I mean, Fruity, that is the implication. <laughs> You know what? If you're a hero won't go down on you, are they really a hero? We'll just leave it at that for now. Oh. Wowie. Hi, friends. Again, this is a hell of a way to start, start a stream. My god. Oh. I wasn't prepared for this at all. Um... But here we are. <laughs> I mean, just what's the, what's the point? Just what's the point? <laughs> like, if you're gonna if you're gonna be if you're gonna be getting physical with your partner, which it's cool if you're not, whatever. But like, if you're gonna, what's what's the point of keeping them around if they're not gonna? This is why Harley and Ivy ended up with each other. <laughs> if the others aren't going to do it, they'll do it. Hi, Riley. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate it. God, this is a hell of a hell of a start to a stream. <laughs> DC is a coward. <laughs> Harley and Ivy are perfect for each other and we all know it. Um, <laughs> they, they're, <laughs> they were roommates. No, it's true though, Fruity. Cowards. The absolute cowards. Um, hey friends, we're gonna do control tonight, but I kind of like these hot takes. Maybe we'll just do this for the stream. No, we won't. We're gonna, we're gonna do more control tonight. <laughs> It's a little- I mean, it's definitely not out of the norm for for our usual conversations. Definitely not how we usually start the stream, so I guess we could consider that out of the norm a smidge. <laughs> Two bros sitting in a hot tub, six feet apart because they're not gay. Um, God, we gotta get Fruity into vines! I need you- Fruity, I need you to understand what we're referencing all the time. Um, yeah, it's just, it's a just chatting stream. We're just gonna diss on Batman for three hours. It's gonna be really good. Um, no, <laughs> we're gonna do control today. Thank you, Allie. I need this. I need this in my life. I didn't know I needed to trash on Batman as, as much as we are today, but it's what we needed. Um, <laughs> anyway, hello, Riley. Welcome. Uh, we're happy to have you here. Also, thank you <laughs> for the couple around my hair. I, I like it. Um, but yeah, we're going to do more control today. I'm, I'm eager to get back to it just to see if I can deal with it. Uh, <laughs> I'm realizing some of my angst <laughs> from last week wasn't necessarily due to the game. There was just a lot going on and I didn't realize it. Um... I still stand by some of what I said previously, but we're going to give it another shot. We'll make it happen. It's going to be good. Um, so I think we'll just, we'll just, we'll just do it while I'm getting this set up. How are y'all doing? How are you? <laughs> how's, how's y'all day been? I know I've seen some of you already today because of our afternoon stream, but that was a few hours ago. Things could have changed. I got all my drinks. I need to make sure not to punch them. Breathing is good. We like uh, we like being able to breathe. <laughs> Allergies getting to you because I feel that one. What are we doing? Now I gotta remember all the controls. <laughs> Ironically. <laughs> this is why you mo I understand. I see. Aha! Uh -huh! 
That's the that's the pickup button. The pickup and throw button. That changes which style of weapon I have. And there's my little there's my quick quick jump. Pew 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 pew. pew. Um, now to figure out where we're going. Oh, this fucking map. Are we? <laughs> it's great because that that sums up at least four variations of what was occurring er earlier. <laughs> Is this the way we need to go? I don't. I don't like this map, and I know I've said that before, but I don't like this map. It's bad. Map is bad. That's probably my biggest complaint, is bad map. Think I could manage everything else. That's a bad room. All right, don't go in there. Um. <laughs> it was very good. I'm excited to watch more uh, Dark Place. Also, I need to turn this up for myself. Signs on the wall say thanks. <laughs> Converters, control room, power plant. I mean, that, that makes sense! <laughs> Following the signs makes sense. I need to pay attention to them more. Um. Yeah, no, none of it is black rock. I need to head towards Atlas Chamber maintenance I just don't know how to get where they want me to go and I think that was part of Black Rock Quarry is this way I d <laughs> come back to me elevator signage isn't great I think that was one of the other complaints I had last time was just that like signs are not necessarily easy to come by. Some of that could just be me not paying attention a little bit. But I feel like some of them are a little out of the way. But map trash. That's the big thing. Bad map. I look a little gaunt. Oh no. I'm, I'm running around. I'm trying to do things fast. I smell a <laughs> Emmy, hello. Very good entr entrance. <laughs> Arcade, hi. I wish I had a duck. I can't get in here. We found a duck last time. We found a little rubber ducky last time, and they wouldn't let me have the duck, and I'm pretty sure the duck set me on fire. <sighs> so, NSC control room, maybe? <laughs> I mean, the du duck is definitely an oop. Um, no, I... <laughs> I threw a blowy up thing at the duck, but I didn't realize it was a blowy up thing. And so I scared myself and thought the duck was blowing me up, but I'm still not convinced that the duck didn't blow me up. It's one of those situations. What's this? Those ducks are tricky. They're crafty, you know? <laughs> Friggin' ducks, man. Sector elevator. <sighs> that one is activated. I know they're save points. I'm pretty sure that one is already activated. <laughs> yeah, it's already. I do have an ability, though. Wait, no, I don't think I can do anything with that just yet. Because we've already been here. At this point, that's that's 
what's confusing me is that it's like making me backtrack. But everything looks the fucking same. <laughs> Cause yeah, this is like not where I want to be, but they want me to be over here somewhere. Can I get there from here maybe? Yeah, part of the frustration from last time is just that, like, nothing makes sense. <laughs> I mean, it's like you gotta. Because, like, I see where I need to go. I just have no idea how to get there. Everywhere I'm trying to go just doesn't make any sense. Like, I'm at least on the right foot level I think but none of it makes sense it's great I love it love that for us so yeah it's just gonna be a lot of running around for a minute <laughs> while we attempt to figure out how to get where I need to go Here? Here. No. Like, I keep finding all the back ways <laughs> to go where I need to go. So that it's like, I need to go... It's true. They really did just hire me and go, have at it! And I'm like, well, what? <laughs> if you take anything away from control, it's uh, the importance of orientation. I want to go to that one. <laughs> Make sure your, your employees know what's happening at any given time so that they're not just running around talking shit about your company on their very first day. Oh, that's a, that's a ledge. <laughs> Look, I can get my professional voice on. My voiceover voice. My very nice, reassuring, everything is okay kind of voice, but I'm not gonna. They need to fix it. Enemies mean I'm going the right way, right? The aim. The aim with the, the yeeting is also an issue. But that's, I can work with that, probably. I can make it work. Professional voice. Do you want it with the voice mod itself or just me professional voicing it? You're gonna have to wait until combat's over, that's for sure. Just me is fine, okay. <laughs> um, you're still gonna have to wait, because I have to set a timer. Actually, I can do that now. Hold on a second. Where's my phone? Hi. Welcome to the Federal Bureau of Control. That kind of voice? You want that? I can do that. Okay. Darn. All right. Five minutes is set. We're ready to go. Shooting's a bit loud today? Oh, dang. Let me turn that down just a little bit. I think there's an upgrade to some something that makes the aim better. I know that there are accuracy ones. But that seems a little silly to me. But it's fine. We'll get it eventually. Can things not blow up around me, please? Oh... Is that all of them? Have we done it? Very good. This is gonna be exhausting. <laughs> um, yeah, so I know, sorry. <laughs> I know that there are accuracy boosts. Um, I think the biggest issue is that it highlights everything. And then doesn't always grab the thing that's highlighted. And that's an issue for me. 
Yeah, I think we're going the right way now. Ugh. You can tell because there's enemies. Good night, sir. Hello. Oh. Is that an orb? No. Just a security card. Emmy's knees. <laughs> what is this about Emmy's knees? Get out of here, orb. <laughs> this is a direct violation of at least 12 company ordinances. Go, be gone. Oh no. Sir, I'm gonna need to ask you to stop. Thank you for your assistance. This appears to be the correct way. Oh, oh, I see. Oh, I see. Um, this isn't the right way, but we're in the correct area now. So that's good. Wait a second. I think I've been here before and then yeeted myself off the edge. Yes, indeed. I was going to say you're doing a great job, Keish. But I got distracted by Emmy's knees. <laughs> oh goodness. Um oh, why thank you. I'm here to serve. Okay. Yeah, we've been here before, and I did it bad. <gasps> Lamia. Can we? I need to go up some. I need to get to there. Where is that located? Are we up this direction? Also, why did the world get wobbly? We've done it! <laughs> oh no! This is a hazard. <laughs> Someone needs to inform corporate of this terrible thing that they've done. We fixed it. Oh God. Oh no. Well, I hope there was nothing down there that I needed. I'm not going back. I'm not a fan of any of this electrical equipment. Oh, dang. I need one more. No, that's not what I wanted to grab. Oh, thank God. All right, professional voice is done. That. That's, I'm not even looking up there. I mean, as well as, as well you should be. <laughs> it's a little more forced than my customer service voice, but oh boy. That. Give me that. You try threatening someone in a in a very nice corporate voice. It's work. It's a lot of work. Alright. <coughs> Got that dang cord again. <laughs> I mean, I can imagine. Oh, we're back at Ocean View.
Hello? Wait, so I got two rooms open. Hey kids, could you stop using the library as a playground? They can't and they won't. Oh no. What am I comparing this to? This room? Noise happened. Why don't you go to the park and play tag? Kimberl's got that voice down. Oh, we got it. Puzzle wasn't that hard. <laughs> we could, uh, I'm trying to think of solutions we can have for these freaking children. Yes, we do have a park. It's where the pool is. I j oh. Love kids, but my god, are they the worst. I do everything in threes. Hell yeah, I'm where I need to be. And now, there's a walkway. Do you want me to come up, be uh, come, uh, come over there and beat up those kids for you? How many times do I have to teach you this lesson, young youngins? <laughs> That's How a good time. Do we have to teach you this lesson, old man? Exactly. Um, that is a good way to get through to them, though. Look, if you like this person. If you think they're cool, don't be a dick. A child. <laughs> okay. We need Not to on the infants. Processing. That's where Marshall said we'd find a prism. All right. So I can just yeet myself through the windows, and that makes me very happy. Yeah, on the eleven-year-olds, they should know better at that point. <laughs> And if they don't, then a spin kick is the least of their issues. I'm doing them a favor. Reminder, if the Jesus contents Christ, of your Leo. workspace have been rearranged, removed, added to, or altered in any other way, you should immediately leave the area while speaking to yourself in a reassuring tone. This will not only keep you calm, but also the room. <laughs> Thank you for your Sorry. attention. Can you imagine having to, like, remain <laughs> super chill just to not freak your room out. Also, my face is fine. <laughs> I move so fast that the glass sort of just moves out of the way. That's how that works, right? Um, The Atlas. The Atlas is a physical expression created by the oldest house. Its purpose and function are currently unknown. Uh, the specific shape and dimensions of the Atlas C, or C file ATL03 for said dimensions seem to indicate a more explicit purpose than the oldest house's usual walls, floors, or shifts. The Atlas changes form, but resists observation when doing so. No visual observation has been made during its change, and it only ever occurs between frames when monitored by surveillance cameras. Um, a previous, so it's basically like that one SCP, that if you blink it moves. Or, I guess, Weeping Angels. <laughs> a previous theory was that this change corresponds to house shifts and that the Atlas is a redacted of the redacted itself. However, the shape changes do, uh, do not occur at the same time as the building shifts, which makes this theory doubtful. Structurally, the Atlas is made of the same uh, redacted material as the rest of the oldest house. Further observation will hopefully aid in rediscovering its purpose. Or discovering its purpose, sorry. They don't. <laughs> if by the time they're tw they're like 25 and they don't stop being stupid, it's either going to be 
when they're 50 that they finally realize that they've made a terrible mistake or they just stay that way for forever and you never associate with them because why would you do that to yourself? <laughs> Boop. Can I throw this plant? Broken. I don't know. This is why I hang out with the, the handful of people I do. Yeah. I mean, I would gladly spin kick everyone. Honestly. I'm fighty. What can I say? Also, this is way too bright. Did I change the brightness settings last time? I think I did. a little better. That still seems, like, way overblown, though. Whatever. It's just not being in a super bright room. Unnecessarily bright, if you ask me. That turnaround! to come back so I can knock those shields out. Um, he tried and he did not succeed. Hey, sirs. No oh, fuck. Okay, flying man down. Hey, hey! <laughs> We're fighting because they're bad guys. Interdimensional beings coming to fuck our day up. Also, yeah, they started it. Can I not cleanse you yet? Oh, Ati. Where are we gonna see our boy again? I miss him. There you are! Alright. Y'all done? There we go. Yeah, but he's not showing up enough. And that's my problem right now, is that he's not here now. Speak with Arish. I mean, it's just kind of gen a general rule that, like, all janitors are trash, except for the ones that aren't. Okay, let's... I guess I could just teleport there, right? <laughs> also, why can't I just hover on the ones that are on the map? You don't. You don't find the good janitor. The good janitor finds you. Where's our buddy? Here he is. I vaguely remember where people are now. Never mind! Wait, he's in the Atlas Chamber? Oh my god. Okay. Never mind. I mean, that's valid. It just depends on what flavor of off. Why are you... Why is your face glowing? Where's... Our friend? Do 
During an AWE investigation, our agents discovered... <laughs> Damn, Emmy. You got me. <laughs> it's, uh, it's radioactive. Ocean View Motel and Casino. I'm, I'm slightly radioactive, that's why. Actually. Dream like hell. Darling, what? <laughs> the door marked with an inverted black I should, but that just costs like that, money. It led back to the oldest house, some 2,000 miles from Montana. Oh, I have to finish like the now last of this. Hold on a second. The cord and the increasing numbers throughout the bureau. Hold on. Somehow the two places, they, they became... I mean, I like darling. Each other. The, the it's a goober. The actual physical location of the ocean view is, is, is a mystery. Stepping beyond its walls has so far proven Itchy. impossible. Place of power. <laughs> like Is it a good bow, bow tie? Ouch. All right. Hotline stuff. I don't particularly care at the moment. Now you're dark. All right, they say that he's here. The guy who plays Darling? What? Nah. I mean, I can't say that like I'm shocked. Uh, cause I haven't played Alan Wake in so long. I don't remember what he sounds like. Alright, where's... Where's our dude? Cause it's not you! up here there you are you. I also stand by there needing to be like markers or something that, whatever the fuck that was but we are barely holding on here boss how's the situation outside maintenance what do I tell him the truth is harsh but these people seem familiar with death the hiss are everywhere like Most more of an indication of this is the way you need to go. We need Black Rock Prison to make more. It's the guy. Survivors in the safe rooms. I'm here to check Darling's Black Rock lab. Oh shit! You're Three right. Death, uh, death, yeah, I can see that. Imminent destruction. <laughs> Another day at the FBC. But Darling's lab is just yeah, Darling. Processing. I got Arish just has bad face. <laughs> Unfortunately. Good news is it's right down the hall. Bad news is <laughs> again, he looks like this weird. Monster clay mash the of said. like the ones that survived. Oh shit! What's his name? But we are just treading. God, I knew who he was last time. Keep coming. If it's Rom, it's Rami Malik and team into the containment sector just before the lockdown happened. And shit! What's his name? Dude who was in Midsummer hey, and got you. Um, Will up. Porter. That's his name. They shouldn't rely <laughs> on me. They don't know me. If Rami Malik and uh, Will Porter I failed people. were. You smashed job, into a clay Arish. clay but mess. It'd you be should take your people and get to the base and dissect it. You can regroup there. I'll go deal with this monster. And some Dan yeah, and some Danny from the, from the Mindy Project. Aye, aye, Faden. And be sure to put a bullet in that thing for me. Just, he just... Compared to a lot of the other characters, he doesn't look that great. <laughs> and it's unfortunate. All right, what does this say? Um, have you noticed the recent tension between Trench and Darling? They've both been acting odd lately. Oh, excuse me. Uh, Trench concerns me the most. His sudden hostility towards Darling's projects is very unlike him. He was the one to approve all his head-drawn research in the first place, but after Darling unveiled those HRAs, he was livid. I personally don't see any reason not to equip Bureau staff with an additional protective device, especially not if it's as strong as Darling says. What do you make of this? Have you seen anything from either of them that strikes you as odd? Let's talk in person soon, before the next Bureau heads meeting. Oh, tension! Ranger Squad Charlie 7 returns from an expedition into the quarry threshold just after 0500 Zulu. Can you please state your names and describe the purpose of your expedition? Seven Horowitz. 
Bridgeport Dwell. Our mission I was to map Floyd Bridgeport in 1929. The secondary objective the always was to find a route from the threshold entrance and maintenance to the formation. The secondary objective was not a success. What is the plan? And did you encounter any previously unrecorded event or entity while inside the threshold? No, nothing. Do you think we should tell them about the mermaid? Daddy, Excuse the me? damage. Mermaid? Yes, mermaid. All of us here found this mermaid in a quarry just think sitting think on some black rock. rock. Oh, yeah? She was singing this beautiful be. song. We are moving out of I need to everyone in this room to shut the fuck up. Alluring. I'd say she was more enchanting than alluring. Fine, enchanting. Um, did you tell your CO about this? No. Because it didn't happen. Nothing happened. As usual, the quarry is full of rocks. That's hey, it. Can we go now? Kill that hiss. <laughs> Fuck you guys. Get out of here. I don't like the idea of mermaid hiss. Which I could be wrong, but I felt like that's what that was pointing towards. And I don't like it. Find a black rock prism. Okay. His face isn't doing the thing that the other faces do. Is your face doing the thing? It is! Arish wasn't kidding about that monster. Dang, son. Yeah, their faces aren't great. Like, look at that. They had a jam party and it just got out of hand. Swan boat. Item is made of fiberglass painted to resemble a swan. Foot pedals allow the item to propel forward in water. The item emits a pulse of physical force at an estimated force of redacted. Possible connection to OOP5. Measuring the exact force created by the item has been hindered by concerns with the Human Resources Department. The item was seized from an activity rental service called Redacted, located on Lake Redacted on Vancouver Island, Canada, after it ejected numerous riders over the course of a summer, bringing the boat to the attention of the media. The item was transported to the Bureau by helicopter. A containment specialist accompanied it, sent to recite formulas C9 through 32 recursively. What occurred in the helicopter is not known, but all agents were lost in the crash. The item was recovered and then transported by train. It arrived at the Bureau without further incident. Can I touch it? Where is it? I want it. <laughs> They're all right. You showed me the HRA when I first got here, and the machine that makes them. Yeah, Castaway on the Can Moon. Can help me find a prism? What a what a good movie. not what I was looking at. Look, I want... Fine, I guess I'll take this. Can I... Is that where you want me to be? tell if that's my spookiness or her spookiness. Let's hurry up and find Darlene's lab. I mean, it's not great. We got through it. Like I said, the hardest part is just being able to tell what's 
What's the fogginess caused by whatever I'm carrying? Or the fogginess that she's causing by thinking she's hiding from me? Everything is dark. BlackRock has, has allowed the BR to make great strides in containment procedures since it was first discovered. This report will examine how its very structure is comprised of redacted densi uh, density that nullifies all resonance with a range of blank to blank hertz. BR in, in, uh, innovations that incorporate BlackRock will be analyzed, most notably the fire breaks. Feat uh, feats of engineering designed to contain any future outbreaks, attacks, or other internal threats. The goal of this report is to encourage Bureau staff to explore further innovations using BlackRock, as work in that field has markedly slowed in recent years. We call these areas thresholds. The quarry is one of the more stable thresholds in the maintenance sector. That's, that's where BlackRock comes from. You heard that too, right? BlackRock comes from the threshold. Quarry. So, the prisms must be there too. Think of it as paranatural lead. Our research involves many dangerous things we absolutely need to keep in check. That's what the Black Rock Line firebreaks are about. The Panopticon container cells. Uh, sorry to interrupt, sir, but I need the code for this body elevator. Oh, uh, Emily. The codes. Black Rock. Pope! 665. Name of the beast. Get it? <laughs> you <laughs> fucking loser. Maybe we can do that again. <laughs> darling, you've done it bad. Darling. Hey, hey, darling, you've done Maybe it bad. The quarry. <laughs> Anything else in here that I need? Nah. Ha ha! Level five. Everything here is crazy. Weird, but it feels right. Like how the world should be. Progress. I am in an infinite building leading to different dimensions, and I never want to leave. Even with all the horror, I'm happy. Jesse, have you considered that you're just like a, a work dog? Just you just need right to be busy. <laughs> as long as you're busy, you're happy. I get that. Boop. Boop. Where is that? NSC control room. I want to go through here. Because we're still heading towards the quarry. So, away do we go. We'll just call it up. You know, just to have. Control point. Um. Cool. And I don't think I have any new abilities. So away we go. Oh. <laughs> All right, let's just run. They can't hit me if I'm still moving. <laughs> it's a zigzag pattern, right?
flipped him. Fantastic. Alright, it's not too bad. Let's get that stuff. And there was a file over here. Uh, the NSC was designed by order of Deputy Chief Trench shortly before he became director. The container provides a safe method of extraction of a blank's excess energy output while acting as a humane way to house him. The coolant pumps can- wait. Him? Coolant pumps keep the container and its, uh, whatever, from overheating while the energy is siphoned. The energy is then conducted to the converters where it is in, uh, where it is rendered into a blank through the use of turbine generators. The electricity produced uh, powers the the electricity produced powers the entire bureau, making us completely self-sufficient and effectively invisible on the New York City grid. After NSC 01's disappearance by some unknown manifestation of blank's power, the occupant was restrained and a second model was built. NSC-02 possesses built-in spatial anchors that are designed to prevent any translocative effects of from its occupants. So we're just strapping people down? I mean, granted, I guess, like, I'm assuming it's a, a hiss thing, but it's like, we're still just strapping them down? Using them for, uh, energy purposes? Okay. I like it when they blow up. Alright. Open. Don't beep at me. <sighs> Things. Watch your step. Give me the things. Elevator's broken. Gotta get down the old-fashioned way. By jumping. Don't like it. I also hear, like, croaking. And that's unfortunate. Any more? Oh! Uh. How am I standing here? Now it's very dark. Here another one. Handled. I'm surprised that didn't break more than it did, but oh well. Oh, there's a ladder! Can I use ladders? <laughs> Can I use ladders in this game? Oh, it's on the inside of the elevator shaft. Never mind. It's very dark. <sighs> oh! Alright, well, I guess we're falling down here. <laughs> Any others? Nope, we're good. <laughs> Are we sure? Are you certain? Ouch. Stop. 
poke into my arm. Oh. Wait, no, 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 no. I don't need to go up. <laughs> well, I'll just send the elevator that way. You know, for whoever wants to use it in the future. Good to know about the ladders. <laughs> Couldn't remember. That one wouldn't have helped me though, because it was inside the elevator shaft. Alright, sir. Handled. Anyone else? Oh my god, y'all just keep coming, don't you? Now we're done. Oh, there's so much to look at here. This goes back to the power plant. Is there... We assume there's like a stairway or an elevator or something. Well, there would be, but it's blocked. Good to know. That didn't change anything. Throw is very strong. So that 50% boost we got last time. It makes me very happy. Oh, hiccups. Oh my god. Yeah, I also wish the map would like mark off what's locked or what's blocked or what I can't access. That would be really nice. <laughs> it's like if you're gonna make it very difficult for me to use it at least be nice and give me that need additional diamond blades asap continuous rim this time to get the clean cut research once this black rock shit is tough we're going through blades but like we're made of the damn things the dimensions for these slabs of uh black rock they want are outrageous for all the grief they're causing me these fire breaks better fucking work or work a treat go ahead and double the last order Right? That's all I'm asking. Just a little, just a little mark. Silent Hill does it. You can do it too. No. No. Oh god. Parkour. Not what I expected. Oh! All right. <laughs> well, this is wild. It's over here. Cute little dead end. Fantastic. Love that for us. Is that a person? Didn't even notice. I do like the things that blow up. That makes me very happy. Uh, but. Off 
have stuff. And just hit the enemy, please. There we go. Friggin' orb! Everyone's here all of a sudden. It's a party. Um, that's cool. Love that for me. Mm. I just need to not put myself in a corner. <laughs> as long as I'm not in a corner, then we'll be fine. Are you shitting me? I don't have to fight these guys again, do I? <laughs> I do not. Good. And I can't go through there. So it's around this way. that was a giant just bottomless pit for a minute wasn't gonna be happy about falling into there dude making all that noise? Is there another enemy around here? No, there's definitely another enemy. Where? So what's up here? Look, I can't see you. I don't know why you're shooting at me. Oh, there you are. Problem solved. Handled. It's very dark in here. Don't like that. wanted to let me know where he uh, he was. That's really what it was. I need chair dude to not be hanging out over here though. Preferably. Whoa. Or any of the floaty guys. No, I, I just don't I don't got time for their nonsense. Honestly There's a battery over here. What are you for? Oh, is this how I activate the explosives? Okay. 
But yeah, no. The other guy was just like, oh shit, I see that you're having a hard time, like, locating me. Here, I'm, uh, over this way. Let me help ya. Activated, right? No, now I gotta flip a switch. Can I stealth my way over there? Cannot! Whatever. <laughs> we'll come back for that document in a minute. <laughs> it doesn't. It doesn't, and that kind of sucks. Like, I get not wanting to use that as, like, a main, uh, main way to do combat, sure, but I should be able to just, like, sneak around a bit. Like, I could have 100% told you that they don't have a stealth mechanic, just based on the fact that their crouch mechanic is garbo. Ouch, 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 ouch. <laughs> Can't have both. Seems a little lame to me. Stop hiding! down. Okay. Oh, that's where the screaming is coming from. <laughs> I like that they just kind of ragdoll. That's pretty, that's pretty cool. I also like that their flying isn't actually gliding, they just float above the ground a little bit, so they can't get to me. Hey, hey. Oh my god, come on. Don't worry about it. Is that everything? Is that all the enemies? I don't think so. Music's still a little tense. Oh, there was a document up here. There's a dog human! During my weekly safety inspection uh, to the quarry threshold, I discovered the entire crew in a state of blank. The whole team was redacted, aligned and staring in a uniform direction. The city in the distance, uh, or were aligned and staring in a uniform direction. The city in the distance. Despite my most vocal efforts to gain their attention, they remained blank for far more blank, or far more than blank minutes until I had to resort to literally blanking. Afterwards, they were dazed and could not provide any rationale for their behavior or any specific memories of engaging it. My official recommendation for any crew working in the threshold area is to either shorten the length of their shifts or to carry out mandatory psychological evaluations on a weekly basis. Or preferably both. And maybe we should order another expedition to the city. Dog human! You heard me! I said what I said! 
Got those dang dog humans. I hear another bad sound. And I don't know where it is. There it is. Down you go. Crystal! And there it is. Assumably a real dog human this time. Oh fuck. Prisms, they mean something to you. I need to get this prism to Marshall before it's too late. HRAs? Then Dylan. No! No! Cause that's better than getting got by that thing. That's the wrong button. Am I going this way? No, that's a dead end. That's locked. Oh no! Yeah, not a fan of those. No, Jesse, go up the freaking stairs. There you go. Handled. Bye. No! I don't. I shouldn't have sent this freaking elevator away. duke it out because apparently the hiss are attacking the bad orb and getting got Is there like an enemy of the oldest house? Yeah. All right. No! bad guys no matter what side you're on they're just a bad deal so i guess that would make sense i don't know for part of me for a moment there was like they wouldn't attack each other no they 100 percent would it makes sense <laughs> aww he's floating
the hiss or the FCB? FBC. I thought the FBC was doing that. I mean, it's just everyone hates everyone is my understanding. Excuse me? Game just decided it wanted to minimize all of a sudden. I hate it. I hate the accuracy. I'm sorry, if I'm pointing at a thing, it should die. Also, <laughs> they need to stop being so floaty. If they're not gonna let me hit them with, uh, with my telekinesis nonsense, then I should be able to hit them a little more easily with my bullets. They're so wiggly! Unnecessarily wiggly. Gotta speak with Marshall. Central executive. Get there through central maintenance, can't I? No, I guess I could just fast travel. I kind of just want to fast travel. I know I should try and like learn the layout. I'm not gonna. <laughs> Marshall found! Quest done! Gotta find Lady Marshall. Ooh. At Central Executive, is that what it said? I sure do hope so. Oof. Gotta sit up. <laughs> Lady Marshall. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> In game, Lady Marshall. I'm sorry. Let me clarify. I don't remember Marshall's first name. I'm sorry. Here's Marshall. Colin, any word on survivors? Had to take a detour into the quarry, but I found plenty. Here. Okay. Then I don't feel as bad about we not knowing her first name. Immediately. <laughs> I promised I'd tell you about Dylan once you helped us. And I lied. This is it. She knows. 17 years I've waited. Your brother is here. He was once known as Prime Candidate 6, codename P6. We born what a here terrible after the name. ordinary event. He was groomed to be the future director. He had talents far beyond any other candidate in the program. Of course he did. We found you together. We share a bond. Are you with him now? So you kidnapped him. We took him in. Your parents vanished along I like to think that these thoughts that she's having are him. happening in real time. Eventually, and so there are these like weird 15 20 second pauses between to be the director when Did characters you know finish their sentences and when she is finally this speaks why you didn't bring me here sooner were you keeping me away where is dylan he's kept in the containment sector in a panopticon my brother i thought we were the same what if we are i'm going now I expected as much. I need to go check on something. Something I cannot let the hiss find. Cool, you do that. I'm gonna go visit long. Pope first. You must watch the bureau Because that's gone. my girlfriend. And then I'll go and see my remember, brother. Dylan is dangerous. Do not let him out, Director Fagan. How do I make her stop calling me that? You don't. I'm not <laughs> here for them. Nothing simple here. These people took my brother, but they've accepted me without question. Are they my enemies or my friends? Yes. <laughs> I need to see Dylan. I need to know. We're gonna see him and he's gonna be changed. I wish you could tell me what you know, explain things. Ooh, sorry, I'm trying to like rearrange my Just chair. Stay with me, okay? 
Okay. I could use a friend right now. Ah, dang! That's not your brother anymore. Three ability points received. Abilities. Launch basic enemies and their health as well. 50% damage to launch, or 50% to launch damage. Ugh. I want it. Keep doing it. That's three, I guess. Okay. <laughs> Astral constructs. Hmm. Alright, I think. <gasps> Outfits! Oh, I still only have the one. Alright, never mind. <laughs> Alright, so we gotta head to containment in the Panopticon. Do we have any other. I mean, we could, we could continue on with the main missions that they want us to do. Or. We could do other things. <laughs> Um, do we have anything better here? What does this do? Damage we're low on health. <gasps> I can have a second mod. What is this one? That's health, isn't it? Um, health recovery is better. Okay, yeah. Health boost. Evade energy cost. Launch efficiency cost. We'll do that. Hmm. I do love me my shotgun, but I should try this. Track. Research hypnosis lab. Where is that? Oh, pneumatics is over there. We have that timed quest. Is Pope in here? Speaking of. <gasps> Jesse, when you were down in research, did you run into a Dr. Rhea Underhill? I didn't. Who is she? She was, is, a colleague of mine. A researcher studying a kind of extra-dimensional mold growing below research. Oh. Well, I don't like the sound of that. No I know where does. that is. Look, I haven't heard from Rhea <laughs> since the Hisseron. <laughs> Would you mind having a look Excuse around me. for her next time you're in research? Of course. Thanks, Jesse. But what if I yeah, what's on your mind? Don't <laughs> Blackrock. I visited the quarry. What's the plan for all that black rock? Yeah. has used black rock <sighs> almost exclusively for containment purposes. And I say branch out instead of boxes, helmets. I was gonna instead say since shields, knives. Pope wants us to do what I gotta do it, yes, but I'm definitely knives. gonna wait a little so bit. Many combat <laughs> applications. Slicing, stabbing, gouging. Very excited about this. Sorry, <laughs> I've been trying to get Darling to explore combat applications for years. I've got a little excited. A little. Wow, I did not expect that from her. Um, this place Arish? is looking good. Arish is making real progress around here. Right, this place is a fortress. With him taking care of operations here, I can spend more time analyzing the hits. I've been attempting to isolate and neutralize the Hiss resonance in blood samples, but no luck so far. But you're so trying. So you can't reverse it. 
Not yet, but perhaps reversing it is too simple. See, if his resonance can rewrite human genetics, then perhaps it's a question of rewriting the his resonance. In theory, that could pave the way for custom human genetic alteration. <laughs> Jesse's just over here, like in the phrase "mad scientist." Not in her head, like she her. understands what's happening. It's okay. How just let, HRA just let, just let Pope be excited. Better than expected. We've already made enough to get people out of a couple safe rooms, and they're here, alive, thanks to you. And we never would have lasted this long if you hadn't walked in those doors. You're welcome. You deserve thanks too, of course. We got this place up and running together. Cool. I should be going. Enjoy your data. Oh, I will. <laughs> My baby. Okay, we need to. It's I want to wanna find this object of power. Let's go see if we can actually do it now. Research lab hypnosis. Research. But not for the bad, the bad mold. <laughs> not for the bad things. Not here for those yet. Unless that's what this one is. I don't think it is. Oh no. Yeah, no, old growth is the terrible, awful cordycept nonsense. this new one that's very nice for burst shots I just want to not be around any of them. disappear though sometimes like in the middle of an engagement is because I walked away I guess you know what whatever if they're just gonna go away when I walk walk off then so be it In parapsychology yes kind of Luck and probability, parapsychology. That 
Hold already claimed. You need to go down. Okay. Oops. Wait, this is where the rubber duck is, isn't it? I've walked into something very weird. <laughs> Mesmerized by it. Is there anything in here? Can't do anything with that. Stop. <laughs> All right, bud. What else? Everybody's being a weirdo. <laughs> Can we? Like. Do anything. So we have to unlock it somehow? We all just chilling, hanging out, <laughs> taking it easy. Working hard, hardly working, right? <laughs> break that window. Like, that's gotta be what I have to type, like, put into the computer, right? What happens if I attack this guy? That one was an accident, but I mean, if we're doing it, we're doing it. What you want? No, it's not. It's not what it wants. I've just killed those people for no reason. Beautiful. Lovely. Perfect. sucks. <laughs> I just want... I want this. Ooh! Give me that dang ooh! Nothing 
shots? <laughs> this doesn't shock me that you know of a bar about Newton's cradles. It shocks me that you've forgotten, though. Like, I get... <sighs> okay, hold on. I understand that to unlock it, I need to do this, right? You wouldn't let me. I swear it wasn't working beforehand. What does it look like? There we go. <laughs> I t how do you how do you remember all these? That's my question. Please state your name for the record. Paul Warren, astronaut, first class. And you are aware that exposure to the astral plane can result in death, disability, personal injury, corporeal entangling, cognitive collapse, loss of ego, and partial to full dimension. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I am. And you acknowledge that your use of the astral <laughs> conduit, aka the X ray light box, is purely voluntary. Yes, I do. Perfect. Your suit is good? Yeah. Okay, you're all set. Open the door for Mr. Warren, please. Future tables, Newton's cradles. Ah. Okay, okay. Yeah, 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 no, I get it, I get it, I get it. Astro plane challenge. All enemies are immune. I mean, I've put that together. Okay, okay, I see, I see, I see. Oh goodness. Did they did they get it? Is it okay? No. Fucking hell. It wouldn't let me pick him up. Oh, that makes sense. <laughs> Good. I'm glad everything's fine now. Good. That's terrifying. <laughs> I'm glad it's all saved. I... I need to pick this boy up. So wait, I have to do it with F to put 
push and hold F. Okay. Weird. I got friends now. Go beat up Gold Boy. about that move. We like that. Alright. What other weird side missions can we do? <laughs> um, oh, I can investigate the safe. Maintenance field training? Oh no. fast or not or or we won't that's cool too <sighs> lace <Lay -sigh>. i <laughs> can we make it happen can we actually get a friend in combat that's the real question Just head to maintenance. <laughs> maintenance sector or maintenance sector access corridor? Maintenance sector. Let's start there. Um, yeah, if I can not summon a friend out in the open, I guess that would probably be helpful. <laughs> so I'm not getting attacked the entire time. Uh, goodness. Let's load up. I think I can get there now that I've got... Well, no, I can't. Why is it still screaming at me? There's like no way to get in there. So I just can't do that now? I, can't, I just can't do that right now. Ooh. All right, back to main stuff then. Um, let's go find our brother. Containment sector. Gotta go to the Panopticon. See what's going on there. Yeah, that's what I've said. Altered items. Maximum security prison. Dangerous. 
Yes. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I've kind of put that together, Trench. one um distorted agent his distorted agents are able to render themselves invisible and emit a powerful concussive blast when in close range to the heart of their target curiously the his distorted is apparently not able to utilize both abilities at once it must make itself visible when it goes on the offensive the his dis uh, distorted is unique in the fact that it wields a paranatural ability previously unknown to the bureau perhaps tapping into a yet undiscovered object of power how does this invisibility work? Does the distorted become resonance temporarily? Does it use his resonance to refract light? The uh, physical deformation of this particular his entity is noteworthy in its thoroughness. Clearly, the human host would have died from such extreme alteration, which prompts the question, are the corrupted simply animated corpses? I mean, probs. It'd be more horrifying if they weren't, though. Uh, X-ray light box. The object is a light box used to examine x-ray images. The image cannot be removed from the light box. The information on the image belongs to a patient named Redacted. The object allows para-utilitarians to for forcefully seize an individual's blank. The seized individual becomes blank to the user. The effect lasts blank. Once released, the seized blank as a result of the psychic trauma. The object has no current binder. A janitor named blank bound the object at St. Anne's Hospital in blank. Soon the building's occupants were redacted by him. Bureau dispatched an emergency response team to redacted the perpetrator and redacted the item. Fatalities numbered in the redacted. Ah, oh, dang. Bad movie. I don't like this sound. Whatever they're doing with the music, they should stop! Reminder, this week, any documents that suddenly appear pink, light red, or any shade in between must be incinerated immediately. Failure to do so will result in termination and possible bodily harm. Thank you for your attention. You're welcome. Too close. I'm using the wrong weapon form. <gasps> get him, get him. Go, friend, go. Get the bad guys, get the bad guys. Fight for me. Don't get shot. Oh, Lord. That's my friend! Alright. I like this one. I like the friend one. <laughs> oh, what's in here? More goodies. Also, I should probably get rid of some of my, uh... My mods. Because my thing is full. Alright, what do we got? Um. More or less get rid of, like, all of these singles. <laughs> Gotta go! Gotta get rid of them! Sorry, buds. <laughs> Different mods. Other mods. 
These mods. Weapon mods. Those gotta go. Personal mods are also full. Oops. Okay. Can I also deconstruct basically all the, the first level ones? Tier 1 ones? I should have... Yeah, most of these I have a, at least a tier 2 in. Get rid of duplicates and any that I have a 3 on. Cool, 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 cool. Now I can pick things up again. <laughs> Don't worry. Your your modding position is safe for today, Fruity. gross one again. Is that... Oh. Oh, I guess it was just the blowy up boys. I thought... I thought it was the big invisible one. We're good. We're fine. <laughs> one of these days I'm going to pit you guys against each other in a very, like, you know, Coliseum-esque manner. And whoever uh, beats the other mods comes out as top mod. Don't worry. Don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> Entertain me. No, not ever. Not ever. <laughs> oh, did y'all not know that's what you were signing up for when you uh, agreed to be mods for me? Ooh, <laughs> my bad. No. <laughs> it's fine. I promise. Where am I going? Hey, I thought I took care of y'all. I hear screamers. Here they are. That's good. That's very good. people to go away please and thank you all done Help. if things could stop getting stuck on corners that would be great i would love that for me In logistics. I need to not be here. We need to go. Oh my god. <laughs> 
sick all their shit. Wall of Honor. I'm terrible. Can I go through here? I'll just let anyone in these days. They won't just let anyone in here these days. I gotta go the long way. exploded. That's not great. <laughs> I mean, that's how you gotta do it. Half the battle is, is trying to figure out how to go about it. Not that I would ever pit you guys against each other in a physical death match, but it'd be very curious. Y'all are very, you're all very smart, and very scrappy. <laughs> nah, if we did anything like that, I would. It would. It would be video game related. <laughs> I feel like it would just mostly be like. I don't know. Y'all are so. Think about shit. You'd figure something cool out. No. Why are these guys here? This is not where you're supposed to be. <laughs> I mean, something like that. <laughs> Have a drink. These guys are actually kind of chumps now that I'm so very strong. <laughs> and oh my god! Get out of here! Why are there so many of them? Are they just like respawning or what? Stop, 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 stop. <sighs> Dude with like the little explosive head kind of looked like the Demogorgon for a second. I didn't like that. Was not a fan of that. I don't think you should be doing that. <laughs> oh, Lord. Wow, this is all bad. <laughs> Y'all each get to choose a game. <laughs> and then we, uh, and then we tear that shit. And then we leave it up to chat to decide who's the ultimate. Oh, 
but like Mario Party, in the end, it doesn't matter. We'll just randomly assign points for bullshit reasons. It'll be great. <laughs> All right. Can we go in here now? No, that's level six. Don't you lie. No one's good at Mario Party. <laughs> Wolf Globe. No unique procedures required. However, contact should be limited as some report feeling disoriented after touching it. Item is handmade, set in dark wood. The item itself is lacquered, hand painted, spins freely on all axes. While the containment or the continents and oceans are recognizably those of Earth, careful examination has revealed numerous blanks and other geographic additions that do not exist on our planet. One of these islands has a city marked on it named Tanrelio. Relio? There are no signatures left by its maker. Physical contact renders subjects dizzy and disoriented, with some reporting a feeling of unfamiliarity with their surroundings. This effect seems to grow worse with prolonged contact, culminating in a sense of listlessness and depression. Suicide has been or has been observed in blank handlers. <laughs> Alright, you know what? That's actually a good strat. I get it. <laughs> You're just there for the pity points. I see. Is it up here? There, now we can get the subtitles. Look at how excited he is. Once we became aware of it, it was there. For the rest of the population, it was hiding in plain sight, a, a slippery blind spot, seemingly discouraging observation. It's a, a place of power, an ongoing AWE of its own, seemingly adhering to its physical outer constraints, and yet constantly breaking the known boundaries of reality. It's, it's unstable, shifting. Note. For more details on control points and the research and process to stabilize and secure the core sectors, refer to a separate presentation. After extensive research and investigation, <laughs> the Bureau made the building its headquarters on November 13th, 1968. The Federal Bureau of Control was never out in the open. This, this was always an obfuscated, classified top secret operation. Obviously. So imagine our surprise when the building's observation resistant aspects began in some unquantifiable way to affect the Bureau as a whole. Okay. <gasps> Give me things. Gib. Is there anything else in here? No. Cell breach? This is what the Bureau calls Dylan. His cell's been breached. Has the Hiss found him? Are you there with him? Can you protect him? No, I think- I think he may have found the Hiss. <laughs> Spooky. One, two, three. That's not great. to write all the rooms, right? Is 
Is that it? Just for being thorough, I'm gonna look in here as well. Is that all I had to do, though? Was just fix that painting? Ladder's still there. So I'm just also just trying to see what's different in here every time. Obviously, the blood. <laughs> um, what terrible thing happened at this hotel? It's been a long time since Dylan and I knew each other. I've wondered about him. What kind of man he'd grow up to be? Were things as hard for him as they were for me? Maybe in here, they were even harder. Archives, P6 cell security. What the fuck are you? Also, Lamia, don't cry! Oh, hello. Hi! Is there something I can help you with? You're okay, baby. I'm Jesse, the new director. I need to get inside. New director? Right. Uh, well, okay. Hello, I'm Frederick Langston, the Panopticon supervisor. Is that literally how you? I just have to get a job? Is just go in and be like, hi, I'm the regions. new Insisted whatever. Insisted across the board, but you're the director, so here we go. Founded by Zachariah Trench, the Panopticon is our state-of-the-art repository <laughs> for all altered items. I don't have time for this. Power and I was told Dylan Faden was kept here. Hi, you I'm your new him? CEO. Faden? Uh, sure. Darling wanted him somewhere secure and isolated away from people. He's in the maximum security cells, upper level. But there's currently a, uh, a pressing matter, ma'am. We, we've got an object of power loose in there. <laughs> it's wrecking the place. The dark <laughs> So, Good point. It's a real doozy. You're not Stop the boss. The team in the yes, I am. You're fired. Get out of here. This is a category 5 OOP we're talking Oop. about. And if we don't contain it soon, it will tear the pen off the con apart. And we don't want all those altered items getting loose, ma'am. No, trust me. Dylan's in there. I'm sure Dylan's fine, Open honestly. The door, Langston. I'll handle it. If you say so. Uh, I usually tell first timers not to touch anything, so. Uh, just do that. I'm gonna touch yeah. literally yeah. everything. Yeah. Fucking and watch me. Now. Call me Fred. No, Thanks. I don't think Thanks. I will. <laughs> Thank you, Jesse. I'm glad that we're both on the same page with that. I told Salvador it was dangerous, but no. Why listen to Langston? The Panopticon. Dylan's close. Okay, but before but we go there, I just want to might wreck this place before I find Look over it. here. <laughs> gotta get that point gotta get that checkpoint do we Ooh. more energy or more health more energy next will be more health astral constructs Right, I need to change. Cool. Um, I want to change this form. I don't like spin. Pierce is precise. I guess let's try Pierce a bit. Well, aiming and zoom and rate of fire or damage against enemy armor. Probably rate of fire. Personal mods. collectibles that I can read? No. Alright. I like that one.
I did that bad because I got too excited about essentially having a sniper. I like that one. <laughs> oh, goodness. Let's try that again. Oh, excuse me. I'm so tired today. This is ridiculous. This last week, I've just been so sleepy. I need to not be. Hello? Look, I'm ready for y'all. Where where are you? <laughs> it's not gonna work. You tried. I appreciate the effort. <laughs> An attempt was made, and that's pretty cool. No! It was appreciated. Fuck off. Some of it just has to do with, like, it's been kind of gloomy out the last few days, or at least from what I can see, and it just makes me tired. And then, I don't know, like, I know there's been a lot going on in general as well. Oh boy. Am I ready for everything to be done? Ready for everything to be chill for everyone. Aw, look at the little picnic basket! I'm a huge metal fan, is what that fan would say, if it could talk. Is that like a carnival mallet? I hope that sometime soon we will all be able to get a lot of rest, because, oh boy. <laughs> That is the direction I needed to go. Yes! Absolutely! I've missed not meeting, like, during the weekends. <laughs> In general. I miss your face, Allie. Yes! I am pretty much free outside of streaming. Hit me up. Let me know when you're available. <laughs> Something went wrong with the Bureau's plan to nice director. Marshall made it sound like Slash, I can message you at night and be like, yo, do a thing with me. Do you want to play some Grounded this evening? Hey, Allie, do you want to play some Grounded this evening? <laughs> or just chat or something. Hey, friend, I miss you. Excuse you! <laughs> Get away! <laughs> following me in this elevator. I'm working on being better at, like, messaging people when I want to do stuff. It's been tough. <laughs> I'm, I'm bad at it. Is, there, is anyone there? Oh, shit! Wait! There's a, there's an indie game based on something like that. Uh, Travis is still playing with Marshall when you're done. Okay, okay, cool. If yeah, if not, Wednesday works for me. Um, what are you doing in there? Oh, this. So someone has to watch this object at all times, or it deviates. My super blazer never showed up. Can you help me? Oh, buddy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a there's an indie game based I'm on sorry. this. Or based on this, or similar to this. I, I don't know which one came first. Okay, just don't forget. 
I can't stare at this thing much longer. Oh, buddy. Okay, my brother can hold on. We're gonna fridge duty. Oh, after after Dylan has been found. Ooh. Um, fuck. I'm gonna need to find it because it's like. Yeah, it's like this dude sitting in a basement just staring at a fridge, but he has to, like... Uh, I mean, obviously, I think it's going to differ from this a bit, but... Uh, that one. His, like, daughter is missing? Like, the fridge ate his daughter? But every time he, like, looks away from the fridge, it gets closer, and it moves, and it growls, but it stops moving when you look at it. But you gotta blink, and you gotta look away to go do stuff. Bridges are spooky. <laughs> that poor dude! I wanna help him! Just gotta wait till I find my stupid brother, though, apparently. LOL! Can't dodge the whole floor now, can ya? Yes! Thank you, Allie. Do not take your eyes away from the red fridge. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's a really neat indie game. Would recommend. I think it's free to play. I think? Um. Yeah, it's a cool, it's a cool concept. I like it. I'm here for it. Yeah, that's the title. Oh, I did that bad. Got too excited about this dang game. But yeah, that's the title of the game. Uh, do not take your eyes off the red fringe. Or away, I guess. Yeah, 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 yeah. Check it out, check it out. <laughs> good is good i love weird That's little indie games like that i need to close it hi, hi television <laughs> i'm getting flashbacks to little nightmares too <laughs> it's not great oh Perspective shifts. <laughs> Wild. Clemson Benikoff TV. All right, but what if I don't? Oof. Oof. They're gonna make me jump down there, aren't they? shame that that does so much damage now. Oh! Dude's over there. Come on, 
Run, just do it. <laughs> Fucking hell. It does look like it's free to play. That's what I thought. It's hard to keep track of sometimes. Um. Yeah, good game. Would recommend. <laughs> It being free to play is just an added bonus. It means you don't gotta spend any money, but also support artists. <laughs> I mean, not necessary. It's a uh, consider it extra credit. <laughs> if you want to check out something that's free slash cheap, would recommend this game. Uh, this one. Do it. I know I said I was gonna start like posting games that I've checked out more in the Discord. I'm bad at remembering to do that, but I'm gonna I'm genuinely gonna try. Um this will be the first one that we start with. <laughs> I also need to like scroll through my my Twitter again and find some of the projects that I'm following. Figure out what's uh, going on with that. Come on, elevator. The real horror is waiting. Hi, llama. What are you doing, Bean? Do you want to say hi? Come here. People haven't seen you in a bit. Come here. <laughs> Look who it is. Don't scratch your belly, and you're gonna like it. Yeah. <gasps> Do you love it? Hmm? Yeah? Okay, I'll put you down. There you go. <laughs> Best bean. Altered items unit. There's a thing over there. Oh, I'm already at the altered items unit. All right, never mind. <laughs> Waited for that elevator for nothing. Where am I going? Fridge guy. So yeah, I wonder, I don't remember when that game came out. Probably after this one. But I'd be curious to know if uh, they drew inspiration from this. Alright, where is Orb? Fucking hell. Alright, we're just gonna keep doing it bad. We're just gonna keep doing it bad. Mommy has been so snuggly the last couple of days. It's been very nice. She, like, won't go to bed with me. Uh, like, if I take her to, like, go lay down with me, she'll just hop away and leave me. But I'll, like, during the many times that I wake up at night, I'll, like, roll over and she's just right there. Right in my face. And it's like, you do love me. My bean. There's the bad orb. Bad orb means nothing if I take care of the enemies first. me. Oh! 
That's too many guys! Busy doing that for me. This way. It's dark and awful. I don't know what's happening. Come on. No, if you're gonna follow me all the way here, fucking come here. terrible thing. Let's not die this time. Do it! I've already got it downloaded. It's ready to go. Whenever you want to play, let me know. <laughs> Joke's on you. I'm always crying in a fear. That's how we roll. That way, no one can catch me off guard! the I wish the point weren't so far away it feels very far away what are you doing you just staring at me okay a weirdo what mommy's being a weirdo yeah this point feels very very far away <laughs> We're just gonna run through. I don't wanna deal with it. That feels much better. <laughs> Not stopping to fight them every single time. Much preferred. Sorry, Lamia keeps, like, doing little circles and then, like, wandering off somewhere and then sitting down and then staring at me. And then doing little circles, wandering around, and then staring at me again. Can you not? Lamia, have you considered not doing that? Why do you hit so hard? hell <laughs> this
this is not great. <laughs> And I get so into it that I stop talking. I don't like it. There's too many guys. Everything looks awful. <laughs> Having everything be red, not a great choice. I see what they were doing. Not a fan. Ugh. <sighs> Now the real question is, can we get through this fight before the end of stream? The answer? Who knows? It's it's extremely difficult to tell the difference between stuff. Like I like it's a neat it's a neat effect, but it just makes it hard. I can only imagine how bad on con or how yeah, how bad it looks like on console. <laughs> Not necessarily bad, but how much more difficult it is. Just very unfortunate, honestly. Oh, it's Salvador! I didn't even realize that. I was too focused on trying not to die. No, having everything be- it hurts my eyes more than anything. And that makes it very difficult to, like, focus on anything. He- there are too many enemies in too small a space. He attacks so quickly. I lose track of everything constantly. <laughs> I like- this is my problem. I like the game, but, like, the things that I keep complaining about- are making it rough for me to continue to like it. Just because it makes it so difficult to stay immersed. That's the issue that I'm having, I think, is that I'm constantly breaking my immersion. And because I get so, like, and it could, again, it could just be, like, a me issue. But because I get so fixated on trying to just get through the section... I immediately lose track of any of the information that they've given us. Not that a lot of it makes sense. <sighs> yeah, it ends up being like more frustrating because I keep dying. Um, and I have to constantly like go through a section like that just like having to deal with those stupid fights over and over again even though i can run through it's just like i shouldn't have to it's it's rough <laughs> some of the other fights like i can deal with it because i can see the enemy i know where they are and even if i can't hit them as easily as i would like it doesn't hurt my brain. This hurts my brain. And I couldn't dodge. And he hit so hard. And it still feels like... It still feels like there's a significant delay between when I... Like, when I hit a button to do an action... No, not necessarily... No, hold on, wait, no. Um... Yeah, no, it seems like there's a there's a delay between when I tell, tell the person to do a thing and when they do it. And it feels a little inconsistent about when enemies can hit me. Also, can you, they stop pointing me in the wrong direction? 
I don't know. It's like... I don't know, and it's, and I know it's weird, because I like games like Dark Souls and Bloodborne, which, I mean, you die an inordinate amount of time for, but, like, I feel like the big difference is that that's kind of the point for those games. I don't necessarily feel like that's the point of control. Um, <laughs> the point isn't to go in and then die repeatedly. <laughs> And it's like, I want to get through the narrative. I want to know what's happening. But I can't do that if I keep dying all the time. guy doing a little better. I have no idea where Salvador is. Oh, there he is. Too close. That thing was Salvador. And now he's gone. Of um. This team didn't stand a chance against the hiss. No one here does. I can. I can see that, and I can understand that. And I like. <laughs> That's kind of where I'm struggling, honestly, because okay. like I get. I get the point that they're trying to make with it. But it just, it feels like they could have done it in a, a a more polished way because honestly a lot of this feels like it just feels like bad design. Um, I don't know. We might give it one more one more try, but it might it might end up being an off stream game. <laughs> Cause it's like Oh, I can levitate now. Okay. Okay. That's cool. Um Well I had more fun this time. <laughs> Cause we weren't just dying. Well, I mean, we were, but not in the same way. And, like, I could find my way around the map. Um, so, you know, that's great. Yeah, I... I don't know. I will think over it um, tonight and tomorrow, because I was kind of considering it anyway. Um, for sure. Again, like, I under, like... It's cool. It's really neat <laughs> that you're able to get that analogy from it. Or, like, can 
see that because again, like I can I can see that being the point of like you know it being frustrating and difficult and not necessarily like super polished. Uh, just because it's I mean it makes sense you inherited this shithole <laughs> and all of its problems with no context and now you gotta fix it all but again I feel like there could have been a, a little bit of a better way to manage that because a lot of the some of the stuff that I'm having issues with just seem feel like issues that I would have with an unpolished game um I don't know. It's it just sucks because I've like very much am invested in like finding the story and knowing what's going on, but I can't. Hey, levitate! Get out of there. Um. But then, like, it just it feels it feels a little obtuse. <laughs> Maybe that's not the word I'm looking for. Um. But yeah, it just ends up feeling... The point ends up getting lost on me just because I end up feeling like I'm just stuck. Um, the combat stuff I can get over, but I guess, like, dealing with... Dealing with, like, the constant, like, not knowing where I am in the freaking building. And, and not even necessarily because it's so immense, but just because, like directions don't feel super clear. Um, I don't know. Uh, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> For sure. And that's, and at least with like the soul schemes, like I understand why that's not appealing to a lot of people. And that's a hundred percent valid. I get that. Like just, but again, like, I feel like that's, like, you go into a Souls game knowing that that's what it's going to be like. I don't think I necessarily went into Control knowing or expecting that. And then having, I didn't really have any expectations other than people really liked it. <laughs> um, do I continue this way? Never mind, it's an unmapped area. Joke's on you, game. It's all unmapped, because your map is so bad. Um. Oh, right. I can levitate now. LOL! Let me just immediately forget the thing that they've already told me. I guess I just get so lost in... Trying to figure out... Me trying to figure out, like, how to word any of this. I guess with the Souls game, there is no, there's no real, real hand holding. There's nothing in place for you to like be able to figure out where you're supposed to go or what you're supposed to do, how you're supposed to do anything. They just throw you into it with zero explanation. Whereas with this, it's, there's enough, there are enough mechanics in this that it feels like you should be able to kind of just smoothly go through. And again, I know that everything I'm saying is reinforcing that whole like, You've inherited a mess, and it's frustrating, and it's awful, and I am here for that. But it's like the fact that they offer a map, and that occasionally they come up with, um, with marker, like quest markers and things like that, just ends up making it more frustrating when they don't work. <laughs> I think I would like it better if they really did just sort of say, like, all right, like, this is kind of the area you need to go in, but I'm not going to give you that reminder. I'm not going to have, like, any markers. You're not even going to have access to a map, as shitty as it is. <laughs> um. <laughs> oh, absolutely. <laughs> I don't know. I've, I, yeah, I guess I've, like, I just don't want to if you're gonna give me the tools to do it, then actually give me the tools to do it. And if you're not, then I'll make them myself. Um, but don't give me a half-assed piece of work. I guess. 
Like, where am I going now? Is this the wrong floor? Oh, doing it bad. Oh my god, where? Do I go down? There's an elevator over there. I don't know where I am. So yeah, it's like, I guess with Souls games, they don't give you any of those tools. You just gotta forge ahead on your own. I can do that. This one offers enough of the tools that you've got the illusion that you can figure it out, but they end up just making it more frustrating. <laughs> And that's kind of where it ends up for me, where it's that, that unpolished feeling um, of like, well, you've got the tools there, why don't they work? <laughs> Hi, Bean. What are you doing? Oof. Elevator. Uh. Yeah, again, it might it might end up just being an uh I don't think I want to go down here, do I? I need to go up. <sighs> sure and I, I yeah I definitely think it's a choice they made <laughs> well that's a choice you made <laughs> is how I'm definitely viewing it and it's and I and I again I get it and I uh I saw Fruity like say that like it might help like remove some of the pressure to make progress for sure I don't necessarily know that that's the big issue that I'm having I mean definitely there is some like issues of me being like, well, I need to, like, progress, but at the same time, I think I would still have that issue off, off stream, where it's like, okay, I'm lost, what am I supposed to do? Like, where do you want me to go? I don't think this is, oh my god. <laughs> I need to go up. I gotta go to the top floor. Um. Yeah. So it's like, I mean, oh my god, stop. I keep, like, opening up Steam overview or whatever the fuck. I gotta go up top. How do I go up top? <sighs> okay, um. Yeah, it might not just be for me. Uh. <laughs> I'll still probably play through it just so I can have, like, a full opinion on it. But I don't know. <laughs> Some of it might also just be that so many aspects of my life are so frustratingly ambiguous as is that I don't need a fucking video game to do the exact same thing to me. Um, <laughs> that might be some of it as well. I don't know. Uh... <laughs> Because again, I'm curious, I'm intrigued, I want to know more about the story, but this, so much of it is just... Again, I, f I feel like I'm just getting hung up on, on design choices. <laughs> and I don't like it. Stop! What the fuck are you doing up there? Whatever, we're ignoring him. I can't go that way. I can't go that way. Is there a place for... Oh, you know what? Can I levitate over that way? Probably can. No! Why are you fall? Oh, no. Oh, I've done that bad. 
It might have been better just to let myself die. Oh no. Okay. I don't think we've been here. I don't recognize this Christmas tree. Why is it smoking? That doesn't seem right. And that one's closed. Um. Yeah, I mean, again, like, there are times where I'm, like, totally fine playing a game that just leaves me feeling empty and awful. Don't think this is one of them. The time nor the game. Definitely not where I need to be. Is that Salvador again? No, it's just. Hey, look, look! I don't got time for you and you're blowing up. Alright? I'm gonna need you to not. Actually, you know what? I might need you to kill me. Actually, go ahead. <laughs> Get me out of here. Get me back to the control point. Let's go. All right, now you. Thank you. <laughs> nah. I'm just trying to think. I knew I. I know I have a. No, I'm thinking of our afternoon streams. I was like, I think I have a game ready for our evening stuff, but I don't because I expected this to take us longer. Um, that's fine. Let's. Pop on over here. Get ready to end stream. <laughs> I am definitely leaning towards uh, this being an off stream thing. I'll think about it tonight and tomorrow. Uh, let y'all know by Wednesday. That's what day that is, right? Today's Monday, right? Yeah. Um. But yeah, this might just be one that I do on my own time or just never come back to. We'll see. <laughs> um, thanks for thanks for hanging out with me while I complain about it. It's like again, it's like it's I don't necessarily want to be like negative about a game. Um, but I will also I also will criticize it if I don't like it, and I'll tell you why I don't like it. <laughs> But again, it sucks with this one because I'm interested in the story. I want to know what's going on. They've got me intrigued. I like weird out there stories that don't necessarily make sense right off the bat. But I also like my gameplay to be playable. And I don't, not that it's not, it's just it's difficult and frustrating in all the worst possible ways for me. And that sucks. I mean, I'd be here for that. I'd be here for that. Allie, do that. Do that. Allie, do that for me. <laughs> <laughs> Please and thank you. <laughs> um but yeah, let's at some point I'll probably like put down in writing my slightly more coherent thoughts on this cuz I feel like some of my my issues right now is me just trying to like trying to verbalize why I don't like it while I was also playing it and trying I don't know. I think I might be able to make it a little more coherent. <laughs> at some point um and also sit on it and really hammer out what about it bothers me um but yeah Allie play control for me <laughs> but yeah let's try and find someone to raid um we'll uh we'll figure it out hey we should we should talk I can I can share my library with you I was gonna say Cyril is online right now. Um, that's who I would I would like to hang out with because I fucking love Ooblets. Um, so if we're all cool with it, we can go hang out with Cyril. Just chill out, get some Ooblets in there, get some nice mellow mellow vibes going. <laughs> As per usual, there are our raid messages. Assuming I can actually spell. 
Allie's already got the sub raid going. It's because I, I spelled it wrong. I did it bad. Um, but yeah, thanks for hanging in there while I just whined about control the whole time. <laughs> I do like having these kinds of conversations, though, where we, like, discuss a game. Like, tell me why you like it or don't like it. Give me, give me the deets. I want to know your thoughts on these things that we're doing. Um, but yeah, let's go say hi to Cyril. Um, we'll be back on Wednesday. I think, I think we're done with Dark Side Detectives. Um, so I'm going to find a different game for us to do in the afternoons. I've been considering redoing, uh, Yuppie Psycho. If people are interested in that, let me know. Otherwise I'll find something else to do and I'll figure out what we'll do on Wednesday evening. Um, I mean, I'm here if I'm here for you being here for my re my angry reviews. It's great. Anyway, let's go say hi to Cyril. We can continue our angry chats uh in the Discord and I'll see y'all later. Take care. Have a great night. <laughs>